Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about surface anatomy of sigmoid major colon. The sigmoid major colon connects the sigmoid colon to the pelvic wall. The sigmoid colon is a 40 cm long S shaped part of the large intestine, a content of lesser pelvis mostly extending from the left iliac fossa to the top of the rectum at the vertebral level s3 its course length and position are variable sigmoid colon is attached to the pelvic brim and the lesser pelvis by sigmoid mesocolon okay now we'll go to the surface landmarks for sigmoid major colon. The attachment of the sigmoid major colon is just like inverted V-shape attachment. The apex of the V is over the left ureter at the pelvic brim, left pelvic brim on the bifurcation of the left common iliac artery at the left sacroiliac joint at the level of the lumbosacral intervertebral disc and mid inguinal point. So this is the apex part, it is inverted V shape. The left limb of the inverted V along the upper half of the left external iliac artery. Right limb of the inverted V extend from the apex to the body of the sacral vertebra 3. Apex is here. This is the apex at the bifurcation of the left common iliac artery at the left ureter. Okay, at the level, level of the lumbosacral intervertebral disc and at the at, at, at the level of the medial point. So we got that. Now we are looking at the landmarks. This is the apex of the inverted V. It is just over the ureter, the termination of the common iliac artery into external iliac artery, internal iliac artery. Its left limb is at about the half, upper half of the external iliac artery. The right limb passes downwards and medially to the level of the sacral vertebra 3. This is the sigmoid major colon and this is the sigmoid colon. This is the rectum. So this is the descending colon, then the sigmoid colon and we are looking the tinea coli end up here and the rectum begins here. Okay, so we got that. Now this is another image. This is the sigmoid colon S shaped. Okay, little bit S shaped and it is continuous with that of the rectum here the sigmoid colon we are seeing the relationship it is passing over the left ureter left obturator nerve external iliac artery left external iliac artery left external iliac vein this is a tinea coli end up at the at the upper end of the rectum here okay so we got sigmoid what are the contents of sigmoid mesocolon, sigmoid and superior rectal vessel? Also contains the nerves, lymph node and lymphatics of the sigmoid colon. Structure crossed by the sigmoid colon. Left ureter, left obturator nerve, left external iliac artery and vein. But it's, it is always variable in length and depends on the content of the lesser pelvis. Okay. So it crosses the external iliac artery and vein, the left obturator nerve, and certainly the left ureter. Okay, and that's all about the sigmoid colon and sigmoid major colon. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me. Please share the information with your friends. Please subscribe me. Please support my channel. Have a nice, wonderful and blessed day. Bye now.